Hey you right guys, Trey from Joey, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 4 of Scam France Season 2. You might be thinking, but Joe, you just did episode 3 like literally two days ago. I did, don't you worry, you're not going crazy. Uh, Scam France are actually dropping two episodes this week, and they dropped the fourth episode, which is like the Easter special one. Um, earlier in the week, uh, instead of clips, I think it's just the full episode, and then we'll get the regular episode 5 around the usual time of when episode 5 would air. Which I like, I like how they've gone about doing that one. Um, I'm not sure if that's how they did it with the original scam, but I like that they've done that with this one. Because if you saw my reaction to the original scam, I thought the Easter special one was fine, but it definitely wasn't needed. I think out of every single episode of scam, that is the one you could take out of the, the series and it would really make a difference. Uh, the only thing it would make a difference for, for me was um, Nora kind of talking to Vilda about her... Um, a diet and stuff like that and then that kind of relates back around to when Vilda's trying to help Nora with her diet so that's the one thing I would have kept from the episode but other than that I think you could have you know removed it and it wouldn't really made a difference and you could have added that scene into another episode anyway I didn't hate the episode but like I say it just it was definitely the, the filler episode so I'm curious if um they'll add more into this version of it or if it'll be pretty much the same of them like playing with a Ouija board uh you know doing nothing I hope it is different I hope they go about it a little bit different that'd be nice um, and then we get episode 5 later this week anyway, which is awesome. So, yeah, I didn't even expect this to be out today. I really didn't, so this is a bonus video. I only plan on doing Fear the Walking Dead and Westworld today, but it's Scam Friends and I don't have time to do it tomorrow because um, I've already planned out the schedule for the week and Scam Friends wasn't uh, on their plan. So today is when you're getting it, which I'm sure you guys are happy about anyway. So, yeah, if you enjoy, remember to leave a like. If you are new, remember to subscribe. And if you do want the full uncut reaction to this episode, as well as all the rest for Scam France, then a link to the Patreon page will be down below. Help support the channel as well. Uh, and make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram, which will be linked down below in the description, where we can talk more Scam, because that's all I talk about at the moment. Uh, but yeah, let's do this. And I've said this in another video as well. I'll be wearing stupid headphones uh, for this episode because my other headphones are at Liam's, and I can't get them until tomorrow. So yeah, this is what we're dealing with. <laughs> One thing about this episode was the jump scare dude. Don't do it to me. I think if anything this could be the one Scam France episode that could top an original episode. We'll see, we'll see. I'm not saying it will. So that's good. Cool. <laughs> Et il n'y a pas une loi qui dit qu'on ne doit pas aller dans un endroit si le GPS marche pas. Um, yo. Euh, c'est qui lui Ah ben voilà, on a Yo, drop kick this guy. On cherche une maison qui devrait pas être loin. Et on ne sait pas où c'est. Vous attendez. Daphne. Be safe. <laughs> I'm a 3 out of 5 of the characters. We found it there. Yeah. Ouais. Je m'appelle Romain. Mmh. Bonjour. <rire> Bonjour. Euh, et on va faire genre, on n'a pas entendu qu'il a dit on à la place de Vejoie. Il trace. Oh yeah, shit. Bien. Yo, what the fuck is going on? Is he going to whip out a chainsaw? Yo, what is this? Yo, I love it. They've gone all out with it instead. Oh. Go on, impress me, scam friends. Do good. Do well. Do better. Bon, tu me yeah. sens, oh, there you go. On est vraiment d'accord là-dessus, et je suis totalement d'accord même. Le truc, c'est que si je commence à fuir Charles, et bah lui, il va partir à... C'est obligatoire. En fait, les mecs, quand ils sont célibataires, ils peuvent pas dire non à une meuf, c'est biologique. Vous voyez ce que je veux dire Ok, donc sérieusement, les filles, là, vous comptez passer tout votre temps à parler de mecs, ou comment ça se passe Il y a des sujets plus intéressants, maintenant Oui, Daphné, il y en a plein. Il y en a plein, je sais pas, on pourrait peut-être parler de, de féminisme on ne peut pas parler du féminisme sans parler de la place des hommes. Et voilà. <rire> c'est incroyable. Pour une fois, on est d'accord, Iman, c'est fou. Et franchement... They agree on something. Qui Damn. Des... On est obligé de parler d'eux. Yo, Vilda's amazing. Pas, on peut faire un Just... jeu de société Ouais, il y en a dans l'armoire. Come on, guys. Yes. The best Vilda we've got. Bon. Oh, c'est un Ouija. C'est the cutest pour, Ouija euh, board ever. On l'avait fabriqué avec oh, ma cousine. Good old fashioned ones. Mamie puis du bec. Putain, j'étais déjà drôle à l'ancienne. Je vais pouvoir poser plein de questions sur ça. Ça va être trop bien, Maria What the fuck 
prie et tu l'as. Est-ce que Charles a une petite amie? I think you know that out of all people if he did. Ok, sérieux, qui le fait bouger là? Arrête Alex, c'est toi. Je te jure que c'est pas moi. Bon, maintenant je veux savoir qui c'est. Non. Bah si. Non, c'est moi. Si, demande qui c'est. Ah ouais. Mais non, mais tout le monde veut savoir. Mais personne veut savoir, Daphné. Remets ton doigt. Gay? Oui. C'est n'importe quoi. No way. C'est n'importe quoi. Esprit, et tu fonces des. Spirit, you high. Ok. Euh. Putain, et puis je sais pas quoi demander. Bah, demande qui est la copine de Charles. Non. <rire> non. Euh... Ok, c'est bon. Yo, Anna's. Oh, et puis, et puis là. Est-ce que, par hasard. Diane aurait encore des sentiments pour moi. Montez vos doigts. Non, on va juste qu'elle est en mauvais. Esprit. Est-ce que Roman est intéressé par Daphné Sérieux I mean. <rire> What Oh, aïe, 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 putain. Et comme Dan. <rire> What the fuck Alex, tu veux trop ta grand-mère à l'envoyer le numéro là Non. Non. Oh, si. Ah non, 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 moi je, je suis très bien comme ça. Je veux juste savoir qui est la copine de Charles. Tu n'as pas chef d'affaire, bref. On est petit Romain 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 Non, mais sérieux, non, Charles ouais. il est pas là. Romain euh... C'est vrai. Mais d'ailleurs. Euh. Alors, où est Romain en ce moment Ok. Do not think about Charles. Crazy. This is why Daphne is the best builder because she is an actual character. Dali? No, that makes sense. Inside it, 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 uh, 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 Je vais peut-être ramener la lumière. S'il te plaît. Non, 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 aux ondes mystiques et Charles il m'a parlé en rêve. Il était habillé, habillé en blanc, il y avait ses cheveux qui volaient dans le vent et il m'expliquait en fait pourquoi est-ce que notre qu'elle connaissait aucun Romain et que personne l'aidait à la maison. Thea Ah non, so Fox, tu m'as dit. Où est mon dog Où est ça Panda. Ah ça y est, ça a chargé. Oh putain, il n'y a pas de bus avant demain matin, on va devoir dormir là encore. Yeah, I'll be running home. I, don't, I ain't staying here another night. I'd like Daphne. Jump on my back, we're going. J'ai regardé beaucoup de films d'action. J'ai développé des techniques d'autodéfense. Au pire, je me cache derrière Daphne et puis elle lui met des coups de nuit dans la face. Emma, they're like... Yeah, Daphne could do like karate. Look at her. Doesn't um, Lula do karate in real life as well? Don't ask how I know that, I just... Voilà, ça c'est bon signe. Ouais, tu fais que manger ici, c'est ça Allez, on doit toutes participer. Il que toi qui n'as pas cuisiné depuis qu'on est arrivé. Oh no, never mind. Here comes the big jump scare. On va pile quand tu dis des trucs chelous, toi. Yo, this is just a sound effect once more. I'm gonna stab myself in the eyeball. Pourquoi t'aimes pas ça Non, les féculents c'est mauvais pour la santé. This was the scene that dragged out for me in the original. Plein de trucs dans ton I know it's important, but it went off like 10 minutes. I was rewatching it with him, I was like, my god, they're like doing a five minute conversation about potatoes. He's going to be in the window! Oh god, it's the windows right in front of them both. I don't know what she says before he comes up. It's super good. Tu sais ce qu'il y a aussi dans la tortilla Il y a des œufs. Et c'est des acides aminés, des protéines. C'est bon pour prendre du muscle. Avec tous les squats que tu fais, bah, je suis sûre que ça t'aidera vraiment. 
Yo, I don't like this. I don't like it. I'm sorry. Comment ça se fait que tu t'y connais si bien en nourriture Oh, oh, it's still coming. Oh, it's still coming. Oh my god, this is gonna be shit on oh, me, dude. Tu es genre video? Plus ça comme tu veux. En tout cas, dès qu'on est arrivé ici, j'ai senti qu'il y avait un truc qui clochait. Quoi? Roman. Again, it's every time they say his name. <laughs> oh, putain, les meufs, je vous en supplie là, c'est trop là, j'ai trop peur. Je le vois. I'm so cute. Daphne. Il faut qu'on nous la porte. Oh, non. Non. Je te supplie, il faut qu'on regarde. Nope. Une place. On va le faire tout ensemble. Ok, j'y vais avec toi. Quoi Quoi Mais ça va pas Non. Mais vous êtes ouf I love Chris, I hope in Emma. I ain't about this life. vraiment de la maison de ma grand-mère avec son père ils refont l'électricité vraiment quelqu'un je veux dire ah mais vous êtes con vous êtes con c'est un truc de en tout cas avouez quand même que la performance d'Iman elle était chambée la meuf c'est la fille d'Angelina Jolie et d'Omar Sy je vous jure mon texte c'est une brève maintenant je vais m'accompagner toutes aux toilettes maintenant on a toutes failli se pisser dessus je veux qu'on aille aux toilettes maintenant Creepy Resident Evil music to top it all off at the end. Uh, you know, I'll give it. I'll give it this. I knew. I even knew that was going to be that window jump scare, and it still got me. Yo, it still got me. That was. That was terrifying. I don't want to experience that again, but I've got to experience that another three times. Italia, Germany, and Austin still have theirs to go. Oh my god, they did that so well. I'm not even gonna lie. I think I prefer that to the original one. I, the episode four of season two is one of my least favorite episodes of Scam. Like honestly, I just think the scenes. I like what they do with it. I like the scenes that they have. But I genuinely feel like the scenes that they do have are just way too long. Like the Ouija board scenes, like five no longer than five. It's like eight minutes. The scene where Nora's talking to Mildred about potatoes is like five minutes. Um, and then the build up to when she has to open the doors like another 10 minutes it's just like I like what they have in the episode I just wish instead of it being like a 20 minute episode or it might have been a 30 minute episode actually it was just all crammed into 15 minutes or something like that um, whereas this one there wasn't like a scene or remember it's like this is dragging whereas it's more so when I rewatched it with Liam because uh, we've just finished season 2 of Scam he's watching it as well but when I was rewatching that episode with Liam I was like this drags out, damn. Like, this episode goes on. Um, and he really didn't like the episode either. Uh, I didn't, I don't hate the original one. It's just, it's one of my least favourite for sure. Whereas this one, yo, every scene was fine. Like, it, it was more, I liked it because they just went for it. They went for like, oh, we're going to make it a scary, you know, throwaway kind of episode. Or not throwaway episode, but a kind of fillery episode. Um, we're just going to go with this horror theme. We're gonna have this creepy music, we're gonna have this this loud warm that kind of went down every time they said Roman's name or whatever his name was, Roman's name. Um they they had like the cliche little jump scare stuff when she jumped behind him and then the window, and then when he came out from the woods, it was just like and then you had all the stuffed animals going around. It was just yeah. For twenty minutes, or not even that it was like eighteen minutes. For eighteen minutes, and so they just went for it. I enjoyed it, I think it was a really good episode. That's one that I wouldn't mind rewatching if I was to rewatch uh, Scam France, which I'll, I'll probably do anyway. But well, I will be because I'm going to rewatch all the episode ones. Like I said, I'm going to compare all the episodes, so I'll be rewatching every episode again anyway. But yeah, that jump scare, dude. I hate horrors, but I love them. You can tell how bad I. It's like something like this that's not even that scary made me want to hide. Then you know, maybe we'll react to a horror film one time. That'd be funny, like Woman in Black or something. But yeah 
Jesus. I enjoyed the episode. Daph Daphne and Emma were adorable. Oh my, the way Emma was like holding on to Chris and being like all scared, it was, <laughs> I don't know, she's just cute, she's so much better in season two, I don't know. And then Daphne just doing her, you know, karate, she was going to knock everyone out. Like imagine if like Chris jumped behind him and Daphne just went like smacked her in the, yo, that would have been pretty hot, I'm not going to lie. But like, Daphne was MVP, uh, Manon was fine, uh, a, a man as well, a man, a, a man, a man, a man? money <laughs> um she like I say i'm not sold on her yet like not all at the moment but she's better this season than she was in season one that's for sure um yeah i enjoyed this episode i'm gonna give it at the end of the day is it was still a filler episode like it's still one of those they could take out and it won't really make a difference but for what it was i'm gonna give it a i think i gave the original like a five out of ten i think um, so I'd probably give this one, I'd give it a 7.5 out of 10. I think it was enjoyable, um, for what it was. So, yeah. And we get another episode in a few days as well, so it's not like it, you know, took a week away from us for a filler episode, which it didn't do that. I'm happy about that. I hope, I hope the others take note of that and do the same thing, because that's really cool. Whew. There we go, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of the episode down below. If you do want the full uncut reaction to this episode as well as all the rest of Scam France, then a link to Patreon page will be down below. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Instagram as well, which will also be in the description. And I will see you next, or later this week, sorry. I'll see you later this week for episode five. Um, the big, I'm not going to read, I'm not going to say what happens just in case people who only watch Scam France, but if you've seen the original episode five, one of my favourites, loved it. Uh, so yeah, hopefully they can do it justice. Until then, 